Tyler one rant. Tyler one Cowboys. Actually, the cringe. So I slept to the first quarter, right? I mean, it is just so un. I'm, I'm sitting there, like, thinking, like, what's the problem? What's going on? We are the softest team to ever exist, you fucking pussies. You are fucking pussies. All of you are such, on, on that defense especially, are bitch-made motherfuckers. They don't want to hit. They're, they are soft. The coaching is fucking trash. Dan Quinn is a bum. Zero halftime adjustments ever in any game. Mike McCarthy, get your fat ass off the team, respectfully speaking. Get off the team, you fucking sorry, uncoachable fucking shithead. You call He's the coach uncoachable. Sucks. That's crazy. He is ass. Zero adjustments. Zero coaching. Dude looks like a fucking moron. Bro, this is a tw this is twenty minutes long, by the way. This is literally we're less than one minute in. This is content right here. The entire time, it's disgusting to watch. Dan Quinn zero halftime adjustments anytime. Can't stop the run. They can't stop the run ever. Why? Because they are soft. They are True. soft. And we got C D Lamb. Yay! Another diva wide receiver. Cry baby bitch. When he doesn't get the ball. Bro, and Dak Prescott is just not him, bro. I've seen enough Dak Prescott to just know that he just doesn't have it in him. So what does Dak do? Because he doesn't want that toddler to fucking cry. He tries to force it to him. And what happens? Oh, pick six. No, Dak, you're still ass as well, bro. Not clutch at all. Dude, the lights are too bright for that guy permanently. Translating That's into league terms. Oh, shit. Yeah. Clicked on uh, his video. Hold it's on. defense off. Translate into league to terms. Him. Like, why do we never, why do we never stop the dive bot? Because we're scared. We're scared. We're scared of being invaded. The jungler is never there on time. We perma path away because we don't want the confrontation. We're never in a position to TP like this type of shit. There we go. And what happens? Oh, pick six. No, Dak, you're pause, still right? ass as well, okay, bro. Good. Not clutch at all, dude. True. The lights are too bright for that guy permanently. The sunlight is too bright. Bro shouldn't leave True. his house. He's trash. He's garbage. Get a new quarterback. See, it's too much to even talk about because they need a new quarterback. They need to do a new D coordinator. They need a new O coordinator. They need new players because they they're soft. Nobody respects their coach. They need a new GM because obviously that has to. That's the only thing that has to. They need at top to bottom. The team needs to reset. I'm not even trolling. It's been 30 years. I haven't seen this team. I haven't seen this team do anything well ever. In my entire 30 <laughs> that's years. That's crazy. I actually, okay, so I'm old enough that I remember when the Dallas Cowboys were actually good. Like when I started watching football, so I started, I, I showed a picture of this on stream. My dad had me watching football when I was six months old. Obviously, I don't remember shit from it. But like by the time I was four to five, like I was watching football. Like I was watching the games and I could tell like who's winning and stuff like that. So like when I was growing up, the Cowboys were like the best team. Like Michael Irving, uh, yeah, Michael Irving, uh, you know, Troy Aikman, Emmett Smith, like those were the fucking guys. Like I remember seeing them be good. Like they were insane. Years of loss, N life, never, not once ever. How crazy is that? Thirty years. Sorry, they are soft from top to bottom. Most penalized team in the year constantly, year after year after year. Junior head coaches doesn't matter. They are soft. They do not want to tackle. They can't run support. They make business decisions. They can't Michael stop Jordan, the yeah, pass. Yeah, I watch Michael Jordan and everything, dude. I, like my, I remember watching Michael Jordan with my whole family just, uh, like, yeah, I mean, easily, easily. Like, 96, 97, 98, bro. I was six to eight years old, man. I was, like, already, like, playing sports and stuff by then. You're sorry. Right? And my dad, like, made me, like, a sports kid. Like, my, my dad, I, I was not playing video games when I was growing up. My dad was, like, every single day, like, outdoors. Like, we're playing some sport for, like, two hours every single day. Like we're throwing a baseball around, we're throwing a football around, we're throwing, we're 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 shooting hoops. Like my dad was like, "You are going to be athletic. You will you will literally just like do this." So you're one of the kids that that actually knows how to play sports, and I think it's actually good for kids to do that because it just makes you like you just get friends in school. If you're a guy that like plays sports, it's just easier to make friends in school. So I think it was actually good with uh, what my dad did for me, like just being able to be like a kid that can throw a baseball well is just good. Where's Bland at getting cooked constantly? That is a sorry ass team. That is a sorry team, without a doubt. Pro that is, has to be the worst team in the NFL constantly. Crazy part is, bro, people sit there for some fucked up reason ever. Like, like, dude, I don't know how like any any analyst or whatever ever pricked the Cowboys watching league. Yep. to do well ever. It's a talking point, bro. It's a talk. I swear to God, all go wrong. Right? It's every year. High school. My parents divorced. So then I was like, "Oh, I can do what I want now." My parents are divorced. I don't have. To. Okay. All right. 
oh, I can't do like sports anymore because like no one can fucking pick me up or whatever. Like I don't like, yeah, like the whole situation. All right, okay. Like now I'm just doing what I want. Now I'm on the computer. Bro, people see the Browns, for instance. They're like, oh, Browns going to suck every year, whatever. They expect it. People see that for some reason, why, why don't the Cowboys get that same shit? I don't understand. It makes no sense. They haven't been good for 30 years, bro. 30 years. 30 years. I'm a young 20. 30 okay, look, look. You ought to know pain. Now that the Lions have won, the Dolphins, my team, we haven't won a playoff game in 22 years, bro. In 22 years. It might be 23 by this point. 22 years we haven't won a playoff game. Like, we are now the worst franchise in the NFL. Just like Kedro. No, Kedro never made the playoffs in his career. The Dolphins make the playoffs. We lose first round. We haven't won a playoff game in 22 years. We made the playoffs last year. We made it this year. We lost first round both times. They're bums, bro. Michael Parsons, you're soft. True. Oklahoma drill me. Five out of five. Best of five. I run your bitch ass. Dude, holy. I would pay to watch that. Oklahoma drill. That's the that's the one on one. That's just the one where you fucking you just start you get up fucking run at each other. That's over every time. You're soft, bro. You are soft. You are a soft ass defense. They don't want to tackle. They don't want to block. Watch the Ravens. Watch the fucking Ravens, bro. Watch how and again the Ravens are playing. It doesn't matter. It's coaching on the Ravens from top to bottom. They have no divas in that team. Why? Because they respect the fucking coach. Run at each other. The defense plays hard. Why? Because they respect the fucking coach. Go watch. That's Ravens how the culture, Raven bro. Ravens have always had a hard ass defense, though. They have always had a fucking defense just full of fucking dogs. DBs play the run. Go watch how the 49ers DBs play the fucking run. Yep. That's they come the up and they fucking hit. They come up and they fucking hit. I love that shit. That's some old school football. Difference, bro. That's the difference. The DBs, the safeties playing the run. Soft. Soft. You are soft. You are soft and sorry. The fucking the 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 Dallas Cowboys, the 2023 Dallas Cowboys. On the D, hey, bro. Hey, I mean technically, hey, you gotta quit it. Boys slogan. Soft and sorry. Star. Make that a, a fucking logo on their helmet. Soft and sorry. The Dallas Ed Cowboys. Reed, I mean all of them, bro. Ray Lewis, Ed Reed, Terrell Suggs. Like these were fucking dogs, bro. I was watching a, a clip of uh I'll just like Ed Reed talking about the film that he watched and like the stuff that he would do to quarterbacks, man. Love that fucking team. Shit's trash, bro. It's trash. It's garbage. It's trash. It's trash. Embarrassed at home. Dropped a 50 point bomb on top of your fucking skull. Just dancing on just dancing on the star. You got embarrassed at home. Yep. To the seventh seed at home. Embarrassed. That's embarrassed. So embarrassed. That's, that's I see so inexcusable, by the way. At home, the Cowboys. One of the biggest fan bases. What the fuck? Eaty bitch ass lamb, you pussy boy. Fucking sitting there laughing with the corner. How you laughing, pussy? You're getting your ass kicked. Oh, you wanna know why he's smiling? Because he had a hundred yards. Ha ha, you bitched and cried until your quarterback finally threw you the ball. Cry, baby bum. You're soft, CeeDee Lamb. You're soft. He's soft. He doesn't care about shit. He just cares about getting his fucking yards. Diva motherfucker, you're soft. Michael Gallup, best game of the season. Quiet and humble, just wants the ball. Quiet, doesn't say anything. Performing. Bitch made motherfucker. Dak doesn't throw it to him more. Why? So CeeDee Lamb gets his yards. Soft. 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 There's nothing they can even do to fix it. It's from top to bottom. It's actually from top to bottom. They're they're completely fucked. Head coach's ass. D, D coordinator. Hopefully he's gone. That guy's a bum. All their players are soft. Soft players come from what? Head coaches. Head coaches. Head coaches. It's culture gap. The head coach has to make sure the players aren't soft. Whether that means cutting playing time, bitching, punishing them, whatever, bro. Mm -hmm. Then I see this Jake Ferguson, number 87, motherfucker, hurt last drive. Hurt. Oh, no, he got hurt. We have the backup bitch-ass tight end in the game. We're down 16, bro. It's your last game of the year. Get your pussy ass in there and play the fucking last three snaps, you bum. <laughs> you are fucking soft. He is soft. He has a, a, a fucking bruise on his thigh. He has a fucking bruise on his thigh, bro. Doesn't want to play last, last three drives. Excuse me, last three plays.
motherfucker. You're going to be on the couch for the next six months. Get your bitch ass in there, pussy. I don't give a fuck, bro. I don't give a fuck, bro. They suck. Big for no reason. 2023 Dallas Cowboys. They're shit, man. It makes me fucking sick to be a fan of this team. It does. It makes me sick. Get rid of Prescott or McCarthy. That, dude, Dak fucking sucks. But McCarthy's a... He can't coach. They all need to go. Their defense doesn't want to hit. They're soft. Pussies. You're soft. Damn. Oklahoma drew me best of five. Any player on that defense, I would put your bitch ass in your back. God. Motherfuckers, they're soft. God damn, Tyler's mad. I love it. Out of my fucking gaming chair. I Oklahoma drew any of that shitty ass defense. Run them over. They're soft. They don't want to hit. Soft. It's crazy, bro. It is what it is. I, I, it's not like I expected anything, right? I didn't expect anything, to be honest. I expected that. But to get 50 dropped in your head by a rookie, a damn near a first-year quarterback and a team full of rookies? Bro, when is the interview? McCarthy's dipshit ass is just going to sit there fucking, well, we, we could have done a little things better. But it's, it's my fault. Uh, I didn't get them prepared to come out and play. Standard response. 10 out of 10 times. I pro ha Has this interview went live yet? It's my fault. I uh, I didn't get them prepared to play the game. <laughs> and no shit, it dip shit. What a fucking disaster. Like I said, bro, I don't like. Like I said, I started watching them hard again. I watched them hard in college, or excuse me, in high school, right? And in junior high, hard. I mean, I was watching. I mean, Tyler is built for an Oklahoma drill too. He weighs like 250 pounds, pure muscle. He's five foot three, insanely low center of gravity, bro. This guy is built like a fucking tree stump. How the fuck are you going to be able to, to, to Oklahoma drill this guy? Or seven, right? I would like cry after the losses. But they were so terrible, I stopped watching in college. I said, fuck this. It's, it's not worth it's not worth that emotional damage, right? These last two years, I started watching heavily again, giving them another chance. And it's it's sorry. It's sorry. <laughs> They're sorry. It's a, it's a complete letdown. Crazy, bro. It's crazy. <laughs> You're sorry, guys. You're sorry. Watch this interview on YouTube. It's out now. Oh, it is crazy, man. bro. I mean, I mean, low key. Look, if you, if you, look, if Tyler one shaved that hair again, you'd see it, bro. Great thing is, you watch all these teams, Fire with, like Eichel. young quarterbacks, and like new teams, like young coaches doing all this shit. Like for the CJ Shroud, bro, are you telling me, like that, like no dead at one hundred percent dead ass, no cap, that team, whatever, sure, whatever, blah, blah, blah. CJ Stroud. Looks five million times better True. than Dak Prescott. I mean, but CJ Stroud even... is like a freak. I don't know what happened. Wait, are we in the next game yet? All right, 45 more seconds of Tyler's rant. A lot. Like, he is the truth. That True. guy looks so confident in the pocket, throwing the ball. Dak Prescott looks clunky, like a robot, et cetera, et cetera. It's crazy. That's all coaching. Well, Dak sucks too, but yeah, it's crazy. It's team, it's team gap, bro. It's crazy. To be fair, I put that game in the defense rather than the, the deck. It, no, it's all of them. No, it's 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 defense. It's defense, offense, coach. It's it's all fields. They all got shit on. It's not even like an offensive coordinator. It is a, all coaches, all special teams coach, whatever. Might get an exception. Linebackers coach, wide receiver coach, DB coach. You fucking fraud. DBs are sorry. Gilmore, get the fuck into retirement, bro. Your career is over, bro. It is what it is. You had a good career, bro. Call it. It's done. You're shit, man. Hey, every dog has its day. Yours was fucking a year ago. Retire. Got cooked the entire time. Basic ass routes too. I could cover those. It is what it is, bro. It's just crazy. It's crazy because this team has expectations. Poverty franchise. Disband it. Honest to God. Dude, seriously, there, there needs to be a league-wide review. Seriously, disband the team. I'm not gonna... <laughs> disband the team. Holy shit, this is a legendary rant. All right, let's get into the last game of the day. Dig IMT.